What's up YouTube, Silver Dragons here, and in this video we're going to talk about selling your gold and your silver. Now I know what some of you are thinking, why would I ever want to sell? Well the bottom line is you might not want to sell, but you might need to sell for one reason or another. Maybe it's a good reason or a bad reason, you know, maybe you're selling your silver to buy gold, or you're selling some of your metals to purchase a home or something like that, or perhaps it's a bad reason, right? Maybe you have medical bills or home repair costs or something like that. But it's great that you have silver and gold to sell because if you didn't have it and you needed it, well, then you'd be out of luck. So it's great to have if you ever are in a time of need. It's basically your insurance. It's your savings. So when you go to sell your gold and silver, there are different places you could sell and some will give you more money for certain items than others. So we're going to talk about how to get the most money for your gold and silver when you sell them. So let's do it. Thank you so much for watching my video. I do sincerely appreciate it. If you want to learn more about investing in precious metals, or if you just want to watch awesome videos about gold and silver, make sure to subscribe to my YouTube channel. Okay, so when it comes to selling your gold and silver, there's really three places you want to look at. Number one is going to be a local coin shop. This is going to be the easiest. You can drive down there. They're going to give you cash right away, but they might not pay you as much as, say, an online bullion dealer. That would be your second option and you can always shop around to see who will give you the most money for your precious metals and the third place is going to be uh, something like ebay if you have any collectibles now high premium collectible silver and gold coins usually will do better on ebay than if you sell them to a bullion dealer right because these aren't really bullion there's a lot of value there other than just the precious metal content so if you have any of these like really pricey expensive coins then i would suggest looking at somewhere like ebay or perhaps even a coin shop uh, but really that's going to be your best bet and we're not going to dive into that in this video because we're mostly talking about bullion right so if you got your bullion coins your bullion bars and you need to get rid of those the two places are local coin shop or online bullion dealer now when you go into a local coin shop there's good and bad the good thing is they can give you cash right away. You can sell as little as just one ounce to them or probably even less. And there's not going to be any shipping costs, nothing like that. Uh, but the bad thing is they're only going to pay you what they're able to pay you, right? Maybe they have a lot of a certain item in stock and they don't really need more of those at the moment. So they're not going to pay you as much as if you know, they had none of something in stock, for example. So it's a little bit hit and miss with the local coin shop. But here is a clip of Dennis, the owner of my local coin shop, explaining how someone would sell gold or silver to him. Dennis, a lot of people have been asking me when they go to sell their bullion, um, do they just bring it in to the coin shop? Or, I mean, is there any limit to how much they can sell? Is there anything like that they should know about? You know, it's just as easy as buying it. You bring it in, you hand it to me, I write a ticket, I verify that, you know, the product is, you know, actually what it's, what it is. I look at the screen, I go, here's the price. I ask, do you want cash or a check? And, and that's it. And that's it. So really the process is extremely easy. Most local coin shops are like this. And if you need money right away, this is how you would do that. But like I said before, they can only pay you really what they can pay you. So here on their website, I'll show you their buyback price for American Silver Eagles. Uh, currently, they're only paying like $2 over spot to buy these back. And I don't know if they just have a lot of Silver Eagles in stock right now and they don't really need them or what, but you could get a lot more money for your Silver Eagles if you sold them back to say an online bullion dealer. Here is an online bullion dealer that will buy your gold and silver from you and you can do it all online. You don't need to call them or anything like that. In fact, you can do it any time of the day. It could be two in the morning, right? And so uh, their name is Bullion Max. I'll put a link for them down below in the description. But after you get to their main page here, you click on sell to us. And then uh, this is pretty cool. So. Bullion Max is proud to offer the only do-it-yourself buyback tool in the industry. That's right, you can lock in your price online 24-7 without ever speaking to our buyback specialists. 
process is simple. First log into your Bullion Max account or click here to create one. Then click the button below. It will send you to a new page where you can select the products you want to sell, the quantity, fill out your information, and complete the order. Uh, please note our minimum purchase amount is $1,000. So you have to sell at least $1,000 in gold or silver to them. Uh, otherwise, they won't buy it from you. So that is one caveat. If you only have like one or two coins, you wouldn't be able to do this. Uh, but I've already created an account and signed into mine. And I want to show you what they are paying uh, for the American Silver Eagles. They have this long list of items you can sell back to them. Uh, but we'll click on type one random year. These are the ones that I have. So if I wanted to sell uh, just one, obviously they wouldn't do it, but this is the price, $31.70, which is a lot higher than $25.80, right? So you're going to get way more money if you sell them to Bullion Max, um, even though there's going to be like the small shipping fee, which we can talk about. But let's say I was going to sell them two tubes, uh, 40 of them. They're going to pay me $12.68, right? So at this point, you would simply hit submit. And it's going to say, you know, are you ready to place your order here? And you agree with the terms. And then we're going to go ahead and do place order. Now it says, thank you. Your purchase order has been successfully processed. It gives me an order number. I can uh, view the details here. And down here, I can see uh, payment. This is when they pay me back. Obviously, the status is pending because uh, they haven't received anything yet. I haven't even shipped it out. Uh, and then here is the shipping status. Uh, nothing is shipped yet. You can add your tracking number there. Um, and they do have the invoice here as well. Now it probably took about 30 seconds for me to get the email with the confirmation and the shipping instructions. So basically they tell you how to package everything so nothing's gonna get damaged when you ship it out. Uh, they recommend using USPS registered mail with signature. I know this is a little bit more expensive to ship that way, but it's gonna be the most secure. So I guess it's kind of up to you how you wanna ship it to them. Uh, but they give you all the instructions here and they don't recommend shipping more than $50,000 uh, at once. So I guess if you're mailing them a lot of stuff, you maybe should break it up into uh, separate boxes. And then here is where you would actually mail it to. So it's kind of as simple as that. And if you have any questions, you obviously could call them. If we go back to the Bullion Max website and scroll to the bottom of the uh, sell to us section, they have the how it works and the FAQs. Uh, so basically how it works, this is what we did. We picked what we wanted to sell to them. We locked in our price. Uh, I went over how to mail everything to them. They say for payment, once we receive your package, our inventory team will inspect each item and approve the sale. After approval, your payment will be issued. Uh, so if we go to the FAQs, we can see how quickly are my items verified once they're received. Most orders are verified the same day they're received. However, during busier times, this may take one to two business days to occur. Um, how will you pay out my buyback order? When you place your order, we will contact you about the options to pay out your buyback. Um, let's see, are there any other hidden fees? No, there's no hidden fees. How quickly do you pay? Payment is typically issued in one to three business days from the time your items have been verified. It can take one to two weeks for a check to arrive if you choose that option. So I'm assuming they have ACH like direct deposit or a check. Um, I'm pretty sure those are the two options that they have, although I've never actually gone through with it. Uh, so that was pretty much how to sell to an online bullion dealer. I mean, that's extremely easy to do. If you are going to be selling to an online bullion dealer, make sure that they are trustworthy. As far as Bullion Max is concerned, I have bought from them many times. I've talked to their customer service manager on several occasions, and I would feel very comfortable selling them my gold or my silver. And also their process of doing it all online is so easy. I know for the other dealers, a lot of the time you got to call them and get a quote and there's all of these steps. So it's really cool to just be able to do it all sort of in one place. Uh, so if you want to sell to them again, I'll put a link down below in the description, but just like selling to a local coin shop, when you sell to an online bullion dealer there will be some downsides there is the cost to ship your silver or gold to them so you need to factor that in and also it will take longer for you to actually get your money so depending on how quickly you need to get paid you know you might have to sell locally but obviously if you could get a lot more money selling it to an online bullion dealer you know and you can wait a few days that would be a better option so obviously there's no one right answer for everyone but if you want to get the most money for your gold and silver, you're going to need to kind of shop around, right? Look online, look locally and 
see who will pay you the most and go with them. So if you have any questions, feel free to put those down below in the comment section. I want to say a massive thank you so much for watching and I will see you all in my next video. Silver Dragons out.